Authorities aren't just tracking the spread of coronavirus. CBS 17 confirms some local authorities are tracking your cell phone movement. CBS 17's Mackenzie Stasco is digging deeper into how Wake County is tracking social distancing. Mackenzie. Well, Angela Marius, Wake County says it's using cell phone data from you and I to see if people are social distancing and sticking to that stay at home order. We have various metrics that uh, we use, including anonymous uh, cell phone data that shows that the overwhelming majority of Wake County residents are indeed staying at home. Wake County's Emergency Operations Center is monitoring social distancing through public websites like these. They're so-called social distancing scoreboards that use anonymous cell phone data to track where you go, for how long, and with how many people. It gives government valuable insight during this pandemic, but also unveils gaps in our privacy. They're getting access to mobile, mobile phone data from a third party that tracks this data, that accumulates this data. You have to assume there's no privacy when you're using the phone. Giovanni Masucci is a cybersecurity and cell phone forensics expert. He says you willingly give up your privacy and data when you share your location or download an app and agree to the terms and conditions. The fine print most of us don't read. How important is it for you to have your location on that app, such as Facebook? How much information do you want to give up? And most folks we see are giving up a lot of information because either they don't care or they don't know they're giving it up. Do you think using this anonymous cell phone data is the right thing considering this is a pandemic? I, I believe it's a good thing. I truly do. Now, if you don't feel comfortable with your information being shared, whether it's anonymous or for a good cause or not, Masushi says you should take a second look at the privacy settings on your cell phone and all of the apps that you use. Live in Raleigh, Mackenzie Stasco, CBS 17 News.